guys, welcome to Bush Club. This is our first trip. We are going down the coast from Sydney, 200 kilometers away. So we're going to visit a very, very good friend of mine. It's an Aboriginal community and we're gonna be very, very welcome there. So I'm going down with my best mate, Boogie, come. Hey Boogie, hey. So we're gonna be both of us in the next adventures. This is Lola, his mother. She's gonna stay home with my wife Raquel. But Boogie and I are gonna be out there fishing, cooking, camping, everything we can do for you guys. So uh, we got here all that you need for our camping out there in the middle of the nowhere. Got a rooftop tent only inside here. Got on my dirt bike. Got oven. We got all camping gear here. Food. We are ready to go. Going, buddy. <laughs> You're beautiful. Look at that! Look at that, kangaroo. With all my respect, here I am. Rack Bay Aboriginal community. Such a beautiful place and people. yesterday it was a little bit late so there's no light for my camping setup and whatsoever but this is it so let's start the day this is my camp my roof top tent it's pretty good comfortable a little bit noisy windy but it is pretty good for sure This is my homemade bush clutch stove and oven. I had a tea bone yesterday, pretty good by the way. So this it burns the wood. Another hot plate. And this is the oven. Where hopefully we're gonna cook a nice and taste lobster pizza. I'll try to catch a lobster today. Let's see how I go. This is Boogie, Boogie, good morning. You have a good time? Have a good night? Where's the kangaroo? In the possum, where's the possum? Yeah. I'm not sure which kind of uh, wood the ancient people used to make their spears. And it's not that easy to find a really straight stick in the nature, but 
I found this. So, should be enough. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. Straight enough and long enough. This will do. Yeah, should be enough. It's kind of soft, but I only need one go. So yeah. Really good. I found this flat piece of wood. It's going to be a good chopping board for my tool. factory go boogie go die gear boogie diving gear let's go try to find a lobster So yeah, arrived here, I don't know the name of, the, of this beach, but it's such a paradise, come on. The water is not 100% for diving, but I'll give it a go anyway. <laughs> Good boy, he loves water. So let's gear up and dive.
So first I was diving with the snorkel because this camera support here it's a mouth one so I couldn't breathe and take the video at the same time. But also a spotter in the crevasse, I came back for the camera and um, well, here it is. Here is the spot where I spear. So I kill it with the spear actually and then it was easy to grab it. I'm happy. Very nice specimen. Thank you, gods. Thank you, Yamanja, Netulu, uh, whatever God is watching us right now. Well, well, here's my chopping board being very useful. Let's give a nice clean. Clean up, chop it, and make the pizza. So let's celebrate the lobster. <laughs> Unbelievable, I'm so happy. So now we're gonna. Well, first of all, let's let me drink. So, um, it's too early for to prepare the, the pizza, the, the lobster. So I keep it on mice. And I start to cook uh, beef ribs, gaucho style. It takes a long time to cook it, and um, so yeah, I need to be here because of the fire. I couldn't start the fire, let it cook in, go dive and come back. I couldn't do that because of the bushfires around this area, and it's very delicate. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna start everything here for the beef ribs. And one thing, guys. Enjoy life. Life is beautiful and pass by. So yeah, have a look at this. Let it be fine. And that's how the feast. My catch. Tail is going to that sauce right now. But before. Boom. I just love this. This takes me so deep in my roots. My name is Fab Fabricio, by the way. My friends call me Fiesto. I don't come from South Brazil. My background is Italian from my father's side and very Brazilian from my mom's side. Well, Portuguese, I would say. Maybe Spanish. But the seafood, it reminds me of my, my grandfather and I did my mom's dad. He loved it. He was a fisherman. And every time that I have like a, a raw fish like these lobsters, my cow, my catch. I can feel him next to me enjoying <laughs> and he's very welcome. <laughs> From my father's side, I got a 
Italian kitchen, uh, cuisine, and the barbecue, the Brazilian, soft Brazilian barbecue. Mixed with Uruguay and Argentina, that's my style. That's come from my, my dad's side. So, I was, I talk to never waste any food. So if you catch, you eat everything. At least try. A good massage and rest. Let's see how it's going on. Our, our salt. Look. <laughs> I'd rather eat this with the pasta than a pizza. But anyway, then today, tonight, today is a pizza. Uh, I'm gonna make a, a basic tomato sauce for the vegetarian pizza. So it's gonna be tomato, a couple of tomato. Maybe the, uh, I got some oregano. Actually. Yeah, I got oregano, fresh oregano. Okay. Right. Don't crash it. Here is our sauce. Tomato sauce. Baby. A little bit of chili flakes, that's it. The vegetarian broccolini. I use all my flour. <laughs> I'm trying to deal with the sticking in the in the board, but it's it's all good. Actually. It's going to be a square pizza. So yeah, let's pre cook. So let's pre cook and then oven. The light is going away and my friends are coming late afternoon, that means early night. So I'm not gonna have uh, enough light to make the videos. And I got uh, three pizzas here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make uh, one pizza in the lobster and have a feast on my own before they come. <laughs> so we have uh, plenty of food for them. I'm gonna make a uh, uh, so it's two lobsters and one vegetarian. Yeah, let's do it. So therefore I'm doing one pizza. I'm making one pizza for you guys before the light fades away. I'm adding a few mushrooms, uh, dividing two, the lobster, sauce. We're gonna have two lobster, lobster pizza and one vegetarian. So I decided to add a mushroom in here because I think it's just matches, you know. So. Wow, it's looking great. So let's do it. So, okay, first pizza done. Lobster cut by my on my own this morning. Next to Azipai. 
So yeah, man, I'll do this. Hmm. It's unbelievably good. The freshness of the lobster. The bread, it's so delicate as well. You wanna taste, Boogie? Nah, not for you, mate. You got a bone. Well. Totally worth it. Cheers, guys. I just add some parsley. Another pizza coming out, perfectly cooked. Finally in the tent, time to go to bed. It was a great day. Lots of fun and good food. Unforgettable moments. Tomorrow I'm planning to do a little fishing. And if I catch anything, I would cook for you guys. Otherwise, pick up and go. So, subscribe. Wait for the next adventures. Life goes on, so enjoy it. Bye.